So, you're looking to define your personal style and you need some tips to get you started. Well, good news for you, I have seven-ish tips for you. Tip number one, learn about the different types of style. Now this is a very, it might seem like a very basic idea, but it's really powerful because the more you can define what certain looks are, the better you'll be at saying, I'm not more, I'm not a classical person, I'm more of a bohemian, or I'm more of a high fashion type of style, or even I'm more of the eclectic style, which can be really hard to define. But figuring out what types of style there is will help you find definitions and even descriptions of the kind of items that people who like these styles wear. And it'll make you closer to being able to tell people what your personal style is and to tell yourself as well. Tip two, look at what you buy most. This is a big, big step and it can be really easy actually to just go in your closet and look at all the things you've bought over the course of say like a year or even the past two or three years. Are there things that keep coming up in different ways? That's one of the things that could be really close to telling you what your personal style is. For example, if you like dresses that are shaped a certain way, or if you like certain types of pants styles, that can be a definition of your personal style. It may not be the end all, but it'll help you narrow down what you like to wear. Tip three, look at what you wear and you feel most amazing in. Now, have you ever had one of those days where you will dress up and you look gorgeous? You just think you look amazing. And you go out and you hope everybody in the world sees you and runs into you. Of course, that never happens to me. I always never run into anyone except when I look like crap. But this can help you also define what you feel confident in, what you feel beautiful in, which is one of the three things to define in personal style. So, next time you're heading out and you feel amazing, Take a quick picture and save it, and then come back and put it together with your personal style collection to figuring out, to help you narrow down what you love to wear, what you would like to wear more of, and eventually, your personal style. Tip number four, look at style influencers. Now there's more to style influencers than say, Jackie O or Kate Moss. There's a lot of different ways of dressing. And if you start to just go online, look up style influencers, go on a social media site like Pinterest, look up style influencers there, pin what you like or save the images you like, put it together in a collection, don't even think about editing your thoughts, just go with what feels right in your gut. I like that, I don't like that, I like that, I don't like that, I like that, I don't like that. It'll help you get to the core of what you love. Now it may not be as easy at the beginning to kind of just be like, okay, I'm pinning like hundreds of images, this is not helping. But don't worry about that. Just pin what you like, cut down and save what you like. And you'll be that much closer to figuring out your personal style. Stay tuned for how. Five, explore. Look at fabrics, look at cuts. Look at the way certain designers make certain pieces. This can help you also figure out your personal style. Now, if you look at high-end designer pieces, you might not be able to afford them, or maybe you can, good for you. But even if you can't, just look at what, they, what pieces they make that really speak to you. Save those as well. Look, designers tend to have a certain look, in my opinion. And if you can figure out the designers that you like, that will help you even get closer to the personal style that speaks to you. Tip number six, create a mood board. Now, go online, find looks, outfits of the days that you like, pictures and images of different people's style outfits that you like, save those. Look at magazines, even old magazines. Kind of just browse through them. Tear out the pieces that you like. Save them, put them in a box. Look at nature. Look at things that really inspire you, really speak to you. You can find a lot of colors in nature, in my opinion. So that could be a good way to figure out the colors that you like as well. So don't worry about if you're looking at something that's not really like, say you're looking at a picture of the desert and a sunset or sunrise in the desert and there's lots of blues and oranges and pinks and you really like that. It doesn't have to be an outfit. Even that picture itself can help you get closer to your personal style. 
So look at elements in nature that really speak to you as a way to build that definition of what your style is. Tip seven, biggest step, refine, 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 focus. Now this is where you collect all these things you've been doing and start weeding out the things that you don't really love. When you start trimming down and getting to the core, you'll be able to get to what really defines you. And sure, you'll have all these other tertiary pieces that really look nice, that you like, but you have those pieces that really resonate with you, that really strike a chord. Do that, and you'll be that much closer to finding your personal style. Good luck with the exercise. By the way, before you leave, would you like help with building your personal style beyond the tips covered in this video? I have news for you. Style Peace Happiness is on a mission to help you build your personal style. Sign up and what you'll get is a guide to building. Not only figuring out your personal style, not only figuring out what you should and shouldn't be buying, but also figuring out looking at your closet and trimming out the extra fluff. Getting to the core of things you love and helping you spend your money wisely on things that will pay back dividends time and time again. If you want help with that, if you want to get started building a personal style and wardrobe that really resonates with you, go to stylepeacehappiness.com and sign up to the mailing list. We call them the Style Peace and Happiness Warriors. Join today. Thanks for watching.